Hello, science fans. Welcome to Fun Believable Science with me, Dr. Brain. Did you ever see those dogs that jump through hoops at dog shows and wonder, how's that done? How's that done? How's that done? It's through science. Today we're going to find out the how and the why through experiments. So get your brains ready. It's time for Fun Believable Science. going to look at the science of how dogs are trained. The science is simple. Reward good behavior and you'll see more of it. It's called behaviorism. Do a good job, get a reward. Do a good job, get a reward. If you give a reward, you get the good behavior. Good job, Dr. Brain. Here's your cookie. Hey, thanks. Wait a second! Are you training me? Yes, I am. Yum. So here to help with the experiments is Scruffles the Science Dog. <coughs> to train a dog, you need to know what they like. And with Scruffles, that's easy. She loves treats. So I've got a whole bag full of treats. And I'm gonna give them to the Scruffles, but first make sure that I do crunkling. This way she hears the crunkling noise and she knows that's where the treat is. Good dog, Scruffles. <coughs> Scruffles the Wonder Dog loves treats. Let's see if she responds to just the sound of the crunkle. So we've established that Scruffles, the science dog, loves treats. Let's see if we can train her to do some tricks. First, we'll see if we can reward her for finding the treat in my hand. Do you think she'll be able to know which hand has the treat in it? Guess now. All right, let's see if she's learned her lesson. Here it is in this hand. And which hand, Scruffles? No. So we've trained Scruffles that the treat is in the hand. Will she go higher to get it? Guess now. She did it! Yay, Scruffles! To train a dog to jump through a hoop, always be kind. Never yell at your dog or make them sit. The first thing to do is to get them used to the hoop. All right, let's see if she'll jump through the hoop. Do you think she could do it? Guess now. So what else do dogs like? Bones. So I ordered this bone to see if Scruffles loves it as much as they say dogs love them. I think Scruffles the science dog is saying I love that bone. Now I'm gonna throw the bone. Let's see if Scruffles the science dog will go fetch.
Oh yeah. So now we're gonna try the same experiment with a ball. The chasing balls. Scruff the science dog. Let go of that ball. We'll do that experiment in a minute. We've gotta let some chew time in there. All right, let's see if she goes and gets it. Are you ready, Snuffles? All right, let's see if she goes and gets it. Are you ready, Snuffles? We can all teach our pets, but do you realize our pets train us too? Scruffles the science dog has trained me that when she stands by the door, she wants to go out. And when she barks, she wants to come back in. I've been trained well. I don't even get any treatsies, but I do get a wagging tail. Stimuli is something that has an effect on us through touch, smell, sight, taste, or sound. We can have many different reactions to stimuli, as you can see in these responses here. Of course, Scruffles reacted well to the stimuli of treats and the bone, and didn't really react at all to the stimuli of the ball. In this clip here, hot water is the stimuli, and you can see for yourself the reaction when you touch it. Remember, kids, be kind to your pets and only train them to do things they like to do. With Scruffles the Science Dog, I'm Dr. Brain saying thanks for watching Fun Believable Science and don't forget to use your brain.